In today's video, we are going through a bot that allows you to automate your Instagram commenting in a way that is privacy oriented. So you can just do it right in your browser. You don't need to give anyone else access to your Instagram. And it basically is very undetectable for bots to see that we are actually kind of using an automation tool. All of this is achieved through a tool called axiom.ai which basically allows you to create workflows directly within your browser. The good thing is it allows you to connect to different services such as OpenAI, webhooks and other APIs, which we are leveraging to connect those services together so that you can run them straight from your browser. Another cool feature is that it's free. So axiom.ai has a free tool. And within this video, you will get a download template from that exact automation that I built for making this work. But let's get right into it. I'm gonna show you an example how it works. So as you can see on the screen, we are on my Instagram channel and I already installed the Chrome extension for Axiom AI and opened the Instagram tag comment engager, which is basically what I built. So you can see it's a workflow. I'm going to go through it in a bit, but for now I'll just click run. And once doing that, you will see that a new window opens that is first of all blank and in a bit it will load a specific tag page. In that case, I chose ChatGPT tutorial. And once this specific chat page is loaded, what happens is the workflow will go through, opens a specific post, as you can see. And now the magic starts, which is we are kind of identifying the description. We grab it, send it to OpenAI and ask it to create a specific comment. And as you can see, my hands are up and this specific workflow automation is just texting this comment for me. I don't need to do anything and I don't even need to have it open in the front so it can run in the back so I can just click it away and you know use it somewhere else but i want to show you what it does so you can see that it basically makes or uh, creates a comment specifically for the description of this post and automatically submits it as well and the best thing of all it goes through a specific amount that you can define of uh, posts as you can see now it just switched to the next one i'm not doing anything here it again takes the description checks how relevant it is and then creates a specific comment for that uh, that is kind of engaging and even asks questions. So that is something that I did using just some simple prompt engineering, which you will also see. And this can just continue and go on and on for as long as you want, basically. And it works for any kind of Instagram account. So you just need to have that specific setup, but all of this will be available inside of our resource hub under hub.indigraticus.com. So you can just head over there and download the template for free. I'm not charging any money for that, so feel free to go ahead and just try it out for yourself. It's amazing. All right, I'll just love the run in the background and give you a little bit of a brief on how that works within the workflow. So going back into our actual workflow or Axiom AI template, you will see that first of all, we have an interact with a page interface, which basically means our bot opens that browser and goes to a web page. In our case, I added the URL for ChatGPT tutorial. So in case you want to change that, which you probably will, you just had to search with an Instagram. Just close that up. We go to search, we search for something like ChatGPT and scroll to some of the tags. Um, ChatGPT3 might be a cool one, ChatGPT explained, ChatGPT tips, let's do that one. I'm going to copy the URL, open my Axiom AI template and replace that URL in here and just save it, which basically then goes to this URL instead and scroll to all of those specific posts and comments on them. Then we have a little wait. We have the click element, which basically is the interaction so that we click on the picture to actually open this specific task. And then the next step is where all of the magic happens, basically, where we just get the data from the web page, which in that case is the description what I'm doing then is I wrote a little JavaScript that basically formats that specific text. So removing things like the tags, things where we just don't need uh, because we just want to focus on the description. Then the next step is that we have a chat GPT step, which basically takes that specific description and sends it over to OpenAI, formats it based on a specific prompt we defined and then returns that specific comment we wanted to have for the blog post. In the next step, we just add that comment into the input field of the post. So when we go into the post, this is the input field we target, so we can just write something into it. And then we wait and wait and wait. What we're gonna do here with the press keys is basically just some manipulating so that it seems like we are switching through the posts because that is something that Instagram offers. So you don't actually need your mouse to click from a post to another one, but you can also use keys. So we do like tabbings, we do back and forth and those kind of things just to, to switch in between the tasks. And lastly, the most important step, we basically just loop through all of that. 
So here we jump to step three, uh, two, which is basically just repeating that exact same thing again, and we'll do it for 50 times. So in that case, we basically do the let the automation run for 50 posts, and if we would like to have that for more, we just type it 500 or 5000, so it will loop through that all the time, through all of those posts and comments on them. Of course, that's a very simple template, so you can definitely extend that. You can do things like build up different systems or check for specific content, build a classifier using um, AI that basically checks that you only want to comment on specific things like tutorials or some manuals or something like that. And then even adjust the timing so it doesn't look like everything is texted in the exact same way. So you just bring a little bit of variety in it to make it even harder for algorithms to detect that you're using, using an automation. But I've tried that with 50, for, uh, with 50 t uh, cycles, I think with like five, or s five to 10 different tags and it just worked well. I never had any issue. So feel free to go ahead and use it. As mentioned, you will find all of the downloads within our hub.indicraticus.com hub for free no money needed and you can also try this for free because axiom ai which is this tool here is for free as well in the in the basic version so you have some contingent i think of uh, scenarios you can run for free so you can give it a try that is all for now in case you have any questions regarding that feel free to drop a, me a line in the comments and if you wish to see anything specific that you would like to have automated or you just haven't been able to manage it i'd love to hear about it and see if we can make a video for it thanks for watching and see you next time